One Kansas City neighborhood believes it has the model to help any community fight gentrification. Yeah, right now, a group on the west side of Kansas City is building what they call a business incubator. incubator. 41 Action News reporter Charlie Keegan wanted to learn more about this center designed for the community by the community. How will this work, Charlie? Good morning, Lindsay and Taylor. Think of a business incubator as a place that has the resources to give you the skills to open your own business, to kind of give you that jumping off point. And that's exactly what's gonna be happening inside this new Center for Urban Enterprise behind me. It'll really focus on three main areas. The first of which is cheap, affordable space for rent for an entrepreneur to kind of start their business before they open up their own storefront. Secondly, there'll be workforce training taking place here, but specifically educational programs that focus on uh, high tech skills like coding and IT security. And then finally, there'll be a series of commercial kitchens here in this space to give people uh, with culinary ideas the chance to scale up. Most of the immigrants that come in here come for a reason. They're looking for opportunities to succeed. What we're, can what we're putting together through the Center for Urban Enterprise is that facilitative model to remove the barriers so they can help understand what to move on in life. So it is the Hispanic Economic Development Corporation which is spearheading this project and leading the construction on what will become the Center for Urban Enterprise. If all goes according to plan, that center should open here at 27th and Jarbo in May of 2020. Reporting live in Kansas City, Missouri, I'm Charlie Keegan, 41 Action News Today.